What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here and today we are going to be talking about something that occurs in Smash Brothers, but I'm not sure if this is a hack or something. Let's look into the article right now. This is actually sent to me by Lolly Braxton, who's somebody who supported my channel for quite a while now. Shout out to you, Lolly Braxton. And I also has some funny videos on his slash her channel. Definitely give that a look as well. It'll probably be in her bio inside of her Twitter link. Um, senpai definitely noticed you. Um, not that I'm any respectable senpai. Don't follow senpai's example. <laughs> but anyways, um, senpai noticed me. Look, you can fight Master Hand and Crazy Hand and Master Fortress in first person. This definitely caught my attention the moment that I saw it, so I figured I would watch this video with you guys for a first time reaction, and we'll see exactly what Lolly has shown me today. Um, I'm gonna put my headphones on real quick. We're gonna get into this shit. Okay, so now I gotta do this. Okay, let's watch. Here we go. Final Destination 2015. What is this? What the hell? Wait a minute. What? Oh, this isn't actually the official Smash. Still, kind of crazy perspective, though. Five difficulty settings, each offering a greater challenge. Really, now? I think this is Team Fortress. Unleash the intense power of Master Core. How the fuck did they do this? Fight all five forms of Master Core. What the fuck? It looks so accurate. It looks Master Jai, isn't it Master Fortress? It looks so goddamn accurate, dude. Master Beast. Big props to whoever the hell composed this, man. Pretty damn good. The Master Edges. And then of course, what is he gonna do for the clone form? Ah, the Master Shadow. There you go. Very nice. Alright, so Team Fortress is doing a lot of work, man. They recently um, incorporated a Splatoon mod as well, too. Which basically lets you play the game like Splatoon. Oh, wait. This is the Master Fortress. What the fuck? I never got to see this because I never did Classic Mode on the Wii U. Invite your friends to take down the Master Beast as a team. It's pretty ridiculous. This must be very accurate to the actual fortress, though. I really need to do Wii U Classic mode, man. I need to stop playing around. There's a lot of things I need to do, actually. In the end, choose to end the core or let the core end itself. What the hell? Here we go. Very impressive, man. I don't know how download it in the Steam Workshop. So I think that was Team Fortress 2, right? I hope my information is correct. Um, no destination. Yeah, it was Team Fortress 2. Holy shit, man. Very impressive stuff. I think these may this may just be done by the same people that did the Splatoon mod. I'm not 100%, though. But impressive showing, man. I'm really blown away by how accurate that was. Even with the visual effects and with the way that the Master Hand and Crazy Hand behaved. And then when you went to the core forms, that's where I really got amazed, man. Everything was so accurate and on point. The edges and the beast. We even saw some of the attacking moves that the beast was doing. And then when you had the, ma the Master Giant, those two hand things that he kind of like grabs you with where it's like... Argh! Like, everything was accurate, on point. To be honest, man, I never really played Team Fortress 2. I mean, I know about it, of course. I know it's a very popular game with a lot of people, but it was never really my forte. But this is impressive. The amount of modding that you can do with this game is out of this world. And it's even found its way into Smash Brothers, and it's very impressive to see, you know? Um, also, seeing that they have Splatoon added in on this thing, too. It's a cool looking game, I admit. And who knows, maybe when I find some more free time, I'll give it a little bit of a try. You get, you guys got, I'll do it probably on stream though, so you dudes gotta help me out if I play this game on stream, because, I mean, I'm very confused when it comes to Team Fortress 2, but it has a really big following, so, I don't know, I'll definitely get into it. That showed me 
a little bit more of what it's capable of, and I, and I like the idea. I, I, I really do. I really do. It was well executed, man. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think about this in the comments. I'm pretty blown away by it. I'm definitely going to be playing Wii U Classic Mode to see what that whole Master Fortress thing is about. I'll see also you guys in the next video. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.